Advising schools are making tough decisions to keep your kids safe, and they don't come without pushback. KSNT News reporter Cassie Nichols is live in Tecumseh to explain why some people gathered in protest today. Cassie? Kelly, Shawnee Heights has been remote now for about a month, and after all of this, parents are now expressing concerns in and out of the classroom. Schools are essential and mental health facts don't lie. Those are just two of the messages I read on the signs today at Shawnee Heights back to school rally on 29th and Croco, a busy road where people passing by could hear their message. Parents, students and even alumni came out to argue that students should be back in the classroom. One seventh grader says communication has been her struggle with remote learning this year as she waits hours to get feedback on her assignments. I email my teachers. Sometimes they take a long time to email back and if I mess up, and they take a while to email back. While Shawnee Heights alums haven't experienced what it's like to have remote learning at the school. In class where you want to talk to your friends and do projects. They say it would be different than the high school experience they grew to know and love. Every time you see your friends, you go up and talk to them and everyone would like pile up in the hallways in these little groups. The school district plans on holding a board meeting here at the high school at 7 p.m. on Monday to address these concerns. Live in Tecumseh, Cassie Nichols, KSNT News.